to be here today to give you some updates on uh, programs we've recently accomplished and things that we're looking forward to here in 2021. So very recently, uh, just over the Christmas holiday, we provided toys to 1,500 children attending our schools um, as a Christmas gift, uh, as something that they probably don't often receive uh, either from us or, or from anyone. Um, the holidays in Senegal were certainly a little bit brighter this year. We're also uh, working, just starting this week now, to provide uh, new furniture for two of our uh, schools in Senegal. So brand new desks, chairs, and tables for the students and for the teachers, um, you know, to make uh, coming into school, coming into work, just a little bit more uh, inviting and rewarding um, and replacing some of the old stuff that was there before. We're also, in the next uh, couple of months, gonna be starting to expand our Sonko School. That's the first school that Matt built in Senegal. Um, to provide offices and workspaces for the teachers, to provide additional toilets, um, and also storage for the school's equipment. We're also uh, beginning this month our partnership with the National Ministry of Health in Senegal to provide a pilot program whereby about 800 students at our Medine Extension School will actually receive free health insurance. They'll be able to access uh, preventative and urgent care um, within the uh, National Health Network. Um, they'll be able to get advice on nutrition, they'll be able to get uh, advice on uh, all kinds of different things that are impacting a child's uh, well-being. So that was definitely something we're looking forward to and hopefully uh, going to expand that program to uh, some of our other schools uh, in the next coming years. We're also, uh, in terms of health, something that's you know, very important this year as we look towards the light at the end of the tunnel through the pandemic. Um, we're providing medication to a medical clinic that supports our Natonge School as well as the Zone Sonatel Elementary School. Um, these are in a neighborhood that's kind of on the outskirts of Amour, the city that we uh, primarily operate in. And we are uh, really excited to be providing uh, medication that's going to serve uh, up to 1,400 students attending those two schools. And uh, lastly, but certainly not least, we're continuing our program that we've done every year, which is to provide healthy meals to over 900 children uh, who attend all of the MAP preschools across our network of schools in Moore. So we're really excited about all of that. Hope you're excited too. And want to say from the bottom of our hearts at the MAP Senegal team, thank you so much, uh, really on behalf of not only us, but all the children and the families for all that you enable us to do uh, for the children of Senegal. Thanks.